Cronkite News reporter Tabitha Bland explains why they oppose the construction of the mine. In 2021, Apache Stronghold argued in court that the mine would affect their religious practices. The Arizona Miners Reform Coalition had another concern, the environment. I said I was born and raised in Superior, so mining has always been in my blood. Henry Munoz worked in the mines his whole life, but now he is fighting against one in his hometown. I saw it as my responsibility to educate my community and let them know, hey, you know what? This isn't all what it seems to be. According to activists, the Resolution Copper Mining Proposal poses a threat to the environment, specifically water. The more people learn about this proposal, the more people oppose it. As you can see all around me, I am surrounded by beautiful scenery. But the real question is, what will happen right below my feet? If the mine goes into operation, it will cause a crater that will reach 1.8 miles across. Munoz says the resolution copper mining will use a technique known as block caving. This mining method is used to extract large, low-grade ore bodies. It creates a large underground cavity. We have a replica of the Eiffel Tower, which is 1,080 feet. So that just gives you a, a clue of what the subsidence is going to look like. The Arizona Mining Reform Coalition indicates that block cave mining can have negative impacts on humans, wildlife, and water quality. Cronkite News reached out to Resolution Copper three weeks ago and did not receive a response. According to the Resolution Copper website, their goal is to develop a project that respects the environment. They say they take water seriously. The Bureau of Land Management reviewed the hydrology report for the project and said that the final environmental impact statement should state the possibility of water contamination. Our town's at stake, you know, and if, if people don't uh, speak up and stand up for what's right and protect their drinking water, we're going to end up like the other communities without any water and the demise of our town. Superior has been a proud <clears throat> mining town since 1875, but now they are also prioritizing their water. The Apache Stronghold versus United States case arguing the mine will be reheard in the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. The oral argument will be held next week. In the newsroom, Tabitha Bland, Cronkite News.